Well, you know, I enjoy sharing some good coffee and some good work with each and every one of you every day. I've got my uh, Reform Roasters Total Depravity here. Mm, always good choice. Mm, good stuff. Great stuff, as a matter of fact. Yeah, I want to thank all you for the um, reach out to my birthday yesterday, send me text and um, social media comments, and thank you especially for those who went out of your way to, to give me a call on the phone. I appreciate those phone calls. I really do. That's uh, it's a special thing to me. Uh, matter of fact, my birthday went so well yesterday. I've, I've decided that I'm. I think I'm going to have one every year. How about that? I think it's such a good idea. I'm going to have one every year and for many, many years to come. Um, I've got our good coffee. Now, how about the good word? And today, I got to be thinking, um, in the midst of yesterday, be thankful in all circumstances. And that's from 1 Thessalonians 5.18. Yesterday, there were some things that to be celebrated and some things to remember that had not gone particularly well in, in the past years. And I began to think on all of them, but I had to be drawn back to that same scripture, 1 Thessalonians 5, 18, be thankful in all circumstances, for this is God's will for you who belong to Christ Jesus. Mm. That's hard to do, to be thankful in all circumstances. You know, I remember, I wear this little bracelet here, I was giving it from Brian's in Philippians 4, 4, rejoice in the Lord always, and again I say rejoice. So maybe me just kind of sum it up in my own version, I guess, of how that scripture would run. It says, be thankful that you are where you are, when you are. How about that? Be thankful for where you are, when you are. Uh, I got a friend of mine who says, you know, says, you know what, bloom where you're planted. This is where we are. We found ourselves in the middle of a situation. Some say, oh, well, everything is, is God's will. You know, every, uh, my favorite thing is, is everything happens for a reason. I said, yeah, and sometimes the reason is that we've made poor choices, <laughs> which is one of those things. But you know what? We're, all, we're here where we are, and those are us in Christ Jesus. He's able to work all things to his good. So we just let it go. You know what? I'm going to probably be that thing more often. I'm going to be more thankful. I'm going to be more present. How about that? I'm going to be where I am right here. I'm going to put my head on a swivel. I'm going to be looking around for the things that I can do for those people that are right here in the middle of my my little environment here. I'm thankful for the friends that God placed around me. And judging from all the comments yesterday and all the interactions I had, it looks like I've got plenty of friends to be able to have plenty of time to be able to be in contact with and keep up with. You know, I've been wanting to look to, you know, the prayer of Jabez in order to expand my horizons. Well, you know what? I've got plenty right here within <laughs> within the reach of my hand, within the scope of where I am. You know, I've been looking at doing other things. I've been working on a book and ways to expand and get the message out. But you know what? I think I need to focus more on the content I have for those that are right here where I am. To be content in the content of where I am. <laughs> And where I am in a my locale. You know, I think that's a gift that God can give to us whenever he can give us a gift of contentment. To be able to say exactly what Paul said there in that letter. Be thankful in all circumstances. For this is God's will for you. Let me pray for you this morning. Father God, I pray right now for all those in the sound of my voice and myself as well. Lord God, let us learn to be content. And not only be content, but be thankful and joyful in the midst of everything that's going on around us. Lord God, we know that we can only do this because of you, you who are the Prince of Peace. Father God, you said that to us that you bring us the peace that passes all understanding. We don't even know where it comes from or how it works, but Lord God, we're happy to rest in it. I pray that as a gift to all my friends on the, that are listening this morning. Lord God, pour into their life peace and joy and contentment. And Lord God, in return for that, let us be ever thankful and ever joyful. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Look, I thank, I'm thankful for all of you. I really am. I know that you love me. I saw that expressed yesterday over and over again. And look, you know that God loves you. You've got to know by now that I love you. Get out there and make sure that someone else knows that you love them as well. Hey, you don't have to wait till their birthday to let them know either. Look, y'all have a great day. Enjoy some good coffee, and I'll see you tomorrow.